Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a haul from Wet Dreams Body Boutique. This is her card. And then on the back it just says, thank you for your order. And that's her website. So I've heard lots of great things about Wet Dreams. I've actually heard about her a while ago. Um, and I believe it was Angie that was talking about her. I don't remember what group it was in, but somebody had asked for good uh, body care vendor recommendations and she said wet dreams and I saw a lot of people agree with her. So when I saw that she was doing a restock instead of a pre-order, I was like, absolutely, because I didn't want to do a pre-order and then maybe not even like her products and wait all that time and spend all that money. So I thought a ready to ship would be the best option for me. So that's what I did. And I'm just going to jump ahead and get right into everything. So she did send me a couple of samples. So this is Electric Slide Body Butter. Um, I haven't tried it yet, obviously, because I wanted to show you guys first, but I did get that. And I also got a little mini perfume sample in Bikini Beach, and I'm not exactly sure what all is in this. Um, I'm pretty sure it's on her Facebook page. But to me, it kind of smells like perfumey, florally kind of. I'm not exactly sure what's in that, but it smells nice. I don't think it's horrible. All right, and then one other stupid little thing that I got. I got an extra pump, and honestly, I didn't realize that this was a pump. When I saw it on the website, I thought it was like a sprayer, like an extra spray bottle thing, but like just the sprayer part, because I have a um, body mist from that small good shop and the sprayer broke somehow. Um, I went to go spray it and it just doesn't do anything. So I thought that, that was a sprayer. So I bought one. Um, it's not a sprayer and even if it was, it'd be way too big, but it was only a dollar. So what am I going to do? You know, <laughs> but that was kind of funny. All right. So I got a lip balm in strawberry. I think she only had two options like strawberry. And I think the other one might've been pina colada or something. This smells really good. And it's really, really moisturizing. I have tried it already. Oh, I love the smell of that. And it tastes really good, too. So I got that. All right, I'm not going to go in any particular order. I'm just going to start throwing things out. I do have scent descriptions because she's awesome. And on the invoice, it tells you the scent description. So I thought that was awesome. All right, so I got a body balm in Crazy Cakes. And this is like the one um, that... Oh, what's it called? Oh, L3. She had something like this. So this is coconut infused party cake topped with sugar cookie flavored icing and garnished in waffle cones. Now, she didn't have very many bakery scents or like cookie scents. Most of her stuff was like summer, spring, fruity, floral kind of stuff. So it was very hard to get scents that I thought I would like. Even though I know I'm not as picky for scents and body care than I am in wax. Um, but obviously, I prefer the sweeter candy cookie scents. Uh, but this smells amazing. I can't wait to try it. I got a foaming scrub, suds and scrub, and the scent is Mind Freak. I love that name. And this is pineapple, red berries, and fizzy pop. So I've said before I do not like fizzy scents, but I really wanted to try a scrub, and the other scents that I saw that she had just did not seem like something I would like. This isn't horrible. I do smell the fizzy note in there, but it's not overpowering fizzy where like it tickles your nose. <laughs> it's funny. <clears throat> it's not horrible though. I love the color of it. I love that it's like super, super neon yellow. So I did get that one to try. And then I got a pink Himalayan salt scrub, um, Mermaid Tears, I guess, but this is in Serena. I think that's how you call it. Um, let me see if I can find it. Coconut milk and, and, and I have to flip the page. Oh, it doesn't even say. It's coconut milk and something. I don't exactly know what this is in, but it smells nice. <laughs> I love it. To me, I mostly just smell coconut. And a little bit of something else. I wish I knew what was in there. Because it's just on here, it literally says coconut milk and. And then when you flip the page over, it's like not in there. Oh, it's Island Desire. Okay, I don't know what that is, but. All right, Island Desire it is. This video is so bad, I'm sorry. Okay, then I got a whipped soap body frosting. And this is in Lolita, which I thought was such a cute little name. 
And this is a pink drink made of strawberries, a hint of vanilla ice cream, and warm bourbon, and then topped with fluffy marshmallows and sugar sprinkles. So this was like another sweet bakery one that I thought I would really love. And it does smell really good. I actually like this one more than the Crazy Cakes one, which I did not think was going to be a thing. But this smells amazing. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to start using that either. Okay, then this one's easy. This is just a conditioner in mint. And I've heard really good things about her conditioners. I saw a lot of people buying them with their hauls when they got them in. Um, our color safe conditioner will have you telling your dry hair goodbye. So I guess it's good for colors. Uh, if your hair is colored and if your hair is dry, after shampooing, apply to wet hair and allow to sit for five to 15 minutes, rinse and style. So I'm so excited to use this. And I don't have like super dry hair, but it could definitely do with a little bit of moisture. And I love the smell of this. This is definitely a great one if you're stuffy. Like if you can't tell by my voice, I'm definitely stuffy. Um, if you're stuffy, if you're not feeling well, that is an awesome one. Okay, then I got this teeny tiny little body mist in Silent Night. And this is lavender, coconut milk, and honey. I wash the kids type. And I do really like honey. I wash the kids from Lush. Oh yeah, this is so good. I'm going to spray some right now because I actually went through this very, very quickly and then I had to leave so I didn't really get to test anything yet. Oh my goodness. I wish you guys could smell this. Oh, it's so good. Oh my god. I think I might like that one the best so far. That is amazing. Okay. Then I got a leave-in conditioner. Leave-in conditioners have been my jam lately. I freaking love these things. I have so many of them. So direction, shake well, apply to damp hair, and style as usual. So all you have to do really is when you come out of the shower, um, make sure your hair is a little bit damp and make sure it's not soaking wet because then it won't take, if you know what I mean. So once your hair is a little bit damp, spray it all over, comb it through, and then just um, you can heat style it or you can just let it air dry and you can style it the way that you want to and it'll leave your hair like super super shiny and bouncy and I just love leave-in conditioner so I'm really excited to try hers to see what the outcome is. Okay then the last thing that I got was a spray lotion in Candy Crush and Candy Crush is watermelon, green apple, fresh picked strawberries, and cotton candy. Um, I really wish it was just the strawberries and cotton candy because that smells amazing to me. Um, but it's not bad. It's okay. I mostly smell the watermelon. Yeah, but I am a little bit stuffy, so it could be something else. I do really like spray lotions. I think they're an, a great alternative to like regular lotions. And I just sprayed some on my hands right now. And I'll tell you now, it does not feel greasy. Um, I think I might need another pump though because my hands are pretty dry. I just did the dishes uh, So yeah, two pumps seem to be a lot better. I really like the way it feels like it soaks in really really fast It does not feel greasy or slimy or uncomfortable because you guys know I hate when lotions do that um, Smells really nice I'll let you know how long the scent lasts for because I do like the scent once it's out of the bottle and on my skin Because I know the scent changes a lot like out of the bottle I like it. I like it so far. That's a good one. All right, so that's everything that I end up getting. I try to get a little bit of everything just to try out her stuff, see what I like, see what I don't. Um, I'll definitely be placing more orders with her in the future. It was super fast shipping, and I had no problems on the website, and I know, like, she got plenty of orders. I know she got a lot of orders. Um, I had no problems. I got exactly what I wanted. I did get on there a little bit late, so I'm sure I probably could have gotten more of that bakery scent, um, but I guess that's a popular one but is what it is, right? All right, so that's everything that I ended up getting. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.